Welcome back. Well, being a college student is no walk in the park. You need to learn how to multitask and juggle everything to overcome all those obstacles. So how can you do that? Well, joining us now with tips is Aldia Kekumu, student at Argosy University. Good morning and welcome. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Well, first of all, congratulations. You're Thank going you. back to school. Yes. And you're studying psychology. Psychology, yes. How did you become interested in that? Um, growing up, I think that I was always um, drawn to, to uh, servicing people. Um, I didn't like to see people suffer. And I also grew up with a sister who was completely blind. I have two sisters, they're twins, and um, because they were premature, Alana came home from the hospital completely blind. And because we grew up with her and around that community, it just became kind of my passion, my inspiration to con continue. And now we're looking at some of your pictures, right? Yes. Okay. So, and as we continue to look through your pictures, what has been the biggest obstacle for you to overcome in going back to school? When I decided to go back to school, I was 31. I had just gotten married and I was a stay-at-home mom. I had been working in human services for a long time, servicing people with disabilities, the homeless community, the elderly, and I realized that I could not go on uh, without an education. So I decided when I was 31, I was a stay-at-home mom with my son. I really did not want to sacrifice my family life or my school life. So. Um, Argosy was the best option for me because the classes were at night and um, I was able to keep that balance for my life. And what has been your best experience so far over at Argosy? So far uh, my best experience was the discussions. When I was younger I was in a really bad car accident and I suffered a, a very severe brain hemorrhage that left me with short-term memory loss. I couldn't remember who people were. I couldn't remember what things were called. It left me stuttering for years. And um, in those discussions, I found myself. I found my opinion. I learned about the, the world and where I stood in it. And I learned that I can overcome any of these things. And the only thing that actually really limited was myself. So those discussions are so important. So it seems like Argosy isn't just giving you an education, but it's giving you the confidence um, to be who you are and to find your passion. It's given me the life that I always knew that I could have, that I limited myself from before. And now that I'm graduating um, with my BA, I'm looking forward to actually entering the clinical psychology program in the fall in the doctoral um, PsyD program. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Is there anyone you want to tell? Anything you want to tell students out there, future students, especially those who yes. are juggling so much and think they have so many obstacles that there's no way they can go back to school? You have to learn to be your, your own best friend. You need to put yourself first sometimes and understand that if you don't have the power within yourself to control your life and where it goes, then you can't help anybody else. You um, sometimes especially in Hawaii, we, we like to be humble mm -hmm. and say, no, no, that's not me. Right. But you're actually the only person stopping yourself from being the person you're meant to be. So just invest in yourself and your future, your education, because that's your only life that you're going to get. Mm -hmm. And you don't know what your possibilities can be. You need to um, invest in your potential and um, really just be committed to your future, to your life. Well, congratulations. Thank you so 31 much. 31 years old, with a son, you went back to college, now you're getting a BA in psychology. Yes. You remind me of um, what my mom used to always tell me, education is something no one can ever take away from you. Exactly. All right. Well, thank you so much, Aldea, for thank your story. Thank you so much. Good luck. All right. A quick reminder, if you or someone you know wants to go to college, just like Aldea, you can enter Argus University Scholarship Contest. One lucky winner will be chosen every month to receive a $10,000 scholarship. You can just head over to our website, kwn2.com, for contest details and for the nomination form.